city foraging, southeast Portland, beginning of August, a bag full of plums, an awesome neighborhood tree for any city food foraging, which is amazing. And these guys are so ripe, so ripe that they literally just want to fall right off. So nice and juicy. Mm. We come down every couple days and grab a bunch. Oh, just free food. I live in a city, which is considered actually a food desert. Portland, Oregon, believe it or not, is considered a food desert because there's not much that's grown locally nearby. Uh, there's things here and there, but we don't produce a whole lot of, we don't produce enough food to support our own city. So it's pretty awesome to be able to come and get free food. Stay strong, y'all. A little bit over there was the plum tree. Now we're gonna launch into some berries. And this is right on the side of the street. These are just wild bushes. So a whole bunch of berries to pick and choose. The next tree up is a pear tree. There's an apple tree. And then uh, half a block up is a peach tree. Um, and figs. This is amazing what I can find just walking the dog down the street, free food for me and my family to eat. Look at that, just right over the city sidewalk. Just reach up and grab them. Just touch them and eat them. Got another beautiful pear tree right here. And them's them, them's them, them's them, them's those peaches. Look at these peaches. Look at these. These are just gonna be going to waste, just rotting. Talk about privilege in America. Imagine having fresh fruit growing in your front yard and it just going to waste. That is privilege. You are privileged to be wasting calories that people could be eating. There's homeless people, tired people, hungry people, people that would love to have access to this and it just falls on the ground and rots. That is privilege. The uh, lady that lives across the street just told me what I was doing was wrong and that I shouldn't touch it and that I should just let it fall to the ground and rot. That's even more privilege. Not bad. Whole bunch of peaches and a bag full of plums. I'm happy. <laughs>